What are some recreational activities nature explorers can do in Nigeria? Let's find out. So I am at the Shodex Gardens and um, today I am going to be looking at some wildlife. Um, I spot some turtles. We're going to find out what kind of turtles they are. I spot some baboons. We're going to find out what kind of baboons they are. Um, yes, so live in Lagos, Nigeria. I told you one of the most biodiverse places in the world, I kid you not, um, we're here at Shodex Gardens, um, so this is what I've seen. Although they might seem common, tortoises are actually considered rare. They are herbivores that feed on leafy vegetables and fruits, as you can see. The oldest tortoise um, in Nigeria was said to have lived 344 years old and died in Oyo State in 2019. I am not the biggest fan of seeing um, animals in captivity, but this is the olive baboon, um, which is commonplace in Nigeria. You'll find them in savannas, forests, and grasslands, and they usually live in groups of 15 to 150 members. That's my new friend, um, Diamond. <laughs> Just gave the thing a name. Say hi. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm all right. I'm safe. I just had my snatched <laughs> by a monkey there are several species of monkeys that you can find in the western parts of africa one particular species of monkey that i like is the mona monkey besides having a beautiful coat and a distinctive face they are great acrobats this helps them find food easily and avoid predators and also um try to snatch purses like they just did to me so the mona monkeys are a personal favorite of mine in western africa the Patas monkey is another monkey found in um, Western Africa. Sadly, they are considered endangered. They are hunted for their meat and um, threatened by loss and degradation of their natural habitat. While at the gardens, I also saw crocodiles, geese, guinea fowls, and the cutest African gray parrots. I will surely be back to visit their actual flora garden to see what native plants I can find.